It's been a while since we've done an ice cream video. It has been a while, my little main squeeze. Lemon poppy seed flavor. So Killer Creamery have reformulated their ice cream and uh, it's supposed to be creamier than ever and you're supposed to be able to eat it right out of the freezer. So we're gonna find out right after this. Hey, what's up family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're gonna find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah, so the this folks at Killer Creamery. Like a good day reached out to us and said, hey, we've reformulated our ice cream. Would you be willing to try it? Well, I don't know. Do we want to eat a bunch of ice cream? Yes, <laughs> yes, we jumped at that opportunity. Thank you. So we, have, we haven't had an ice cream review in a while. We really don't eat that much ice cream anymore. So we have eight different flavors. We've got lemon poppy seed called Main Squeeze. Um, there is a chocolate peanut butter flavor called Peanut Blubber. Jam Session, which is raspberry and dark chocolate chips. No judgment, how cute is that? Mint flavor with dark chocolate chips. Chilla in vanilla. Brownie Points, which is chocolate flavor and brownie pieces. Got buns, which is cinnamon bun and dough. And a caramel's back, which is a salted caramel flavor. Okay, so we're gonna try one flavor. I say we go peanut butter. We've always liked this company. Not only have they normally have like really good ingredients, but they always give back to the whales. Yeah, that's whale one thing I love about them. So they support the WDC, the whale and the dolphin uh, conservation. Okay. We are going with. This is peanut blubber. Plays well with others. Mm. Extra creamy right out of the freezer. No need to wait. Dig right in. So we have not like had this in. Yeah. We literally pulled it out of the freezer. But we have had peanut blubber before they reformulated. So we liked that flavor. Okay. Oh, nice. It's not like a brick. It's not a brick. I mean, you can dig into it, but it's not like I'm thinking like creamy. Do you have a spoon over it's there? It's creamier. Yes, I do. I'll trade you. One clean spoon for one filled with ice cream. I feel like I came out better on that deal. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Yes. Way creamier. Wow. Definitely creamier on the tongue. Yes. Again, especially when we have not left this out at all. Man. It is so dense with ingredients, right? Like it's so thick, you almost feel like. I mean, you can definitely like, yeah. You're yeah, eating you can a spoonful of peanut butter. You want, you want a spoonful of peanut butter? Oh yeah. Oh my goodness, that's good. Mm. That's really good. I gotta try one more flavor though. Do you want to mix lemon and Oh yeah, this one butter? is really creamy. Mmm. Is it lemony? I'm kind of like loving my chocolate and peanut butter moment. Just it's not ice cream. I mean, it is, it's the texture of ice cream. It's got the flavor of lemon sherbet. Lemon sherbet. Yeah. Isn't that how you get into Dumbledore's office in Harry Potter? Okay, you ready? So we're, we're gonna go back to this one. Five things review? Five things. Five things. Now we have reviewed Killer Creamery flavors before, but again, new formulation. So we have to do a new five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're gonna talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? Number one. Number one is the ingredients. Cream, water, peanut butter, dry roasted peanuts, salt, allulose, soluble corn fiber, milk protein isolate, natural cocoa powder, egg yolks, MCT oil, erythritol, natural flavor, locust bean gum, guar, bum and, guar gum, and monk fruit extract. 
So as always, uh, clean ingredients. I immediately noticing from the last time we tried Killer Creamery is obviously they've switched over to allulose. Right. Which everybody is. Yeah. Uh, is the soluble corn fiber. So that's like one of those ingredients some people don't like it. Yeah. I'm trying to see is that on everybody? So it's probably what's making yeah. it creamier out of the freezer is the soluble corn fiber. Yep. This one uses erythritol. This they all use erythritol and yeah. and uh, allulose. But the soluble corn fiber, it looks like it's in each it's one. It's in all of them. So that's that's their big difference is, is they're going with soluble corn fiber. So ingredients, not bad. But again, some people don't like soluble corn fiber. Some people have a reaction to it. So it's just something you're going to have to go by. So let's take a look at one of the nutrition facts. I'm going to take so the number two. main squeeze that you had. Okay. So uh, there's three servings in a container. The fat for I this like the one. I like the three servings. Yeah. Instead there's... of four. Yeah. Except for now, it's two for me and one for you. That seems fair. It doesn't split up equally. That's true. Um, okay. So the total fat is 14 grams, uh, four grams of protein, 12 total carbs, three dietary fiber, and three erythritol. So you're looking at six. Net carbs? Two oh, net carbs. oh, two because of the allulose. Six, six per for the container. Yeah. Okay. So one thing I would say is that what's really nice about it, so like, for example, here's the peanut butter one, which I'm assuming is going to be higher. 14 total carbs. So if you eat the whole thing, what is that going to be? 30, uh, what is it, 42? Mm-hmm. 42 total carbs. Now, we would generally, when we eat our ice cream, we just take the whole pint. We're going to split it in half. Yeah. So that's going to be 21 total carbs, but still only like, you know, what's five net carbs, you know, a piece. So I do yeah. like the fact that it is still lower in total carbs. It looks like the highest one of all of these, the total carb count is the brownie points. It's got 16 total carbs and three net carbs per serving. Okay. Number three, how does it taste? Really good. I definitely, it's definitely notice creamier. the difference in creaminess. I really do. The, the the flavor comes out really, really well. I mean, it's the same, like the, the is it? Peanut blubber. Peanut, peanut, peanut blubber. Peanut blubber. Um, it tastes similar in ingredients. If you like the taste of it before, right. you're going to love it. It's still that great taste. But it's definitely taste, creamier. But creamier. Number four, how much do they cost? All right, here we go. Here's the good news. So again, been a while since we've ordered yeah. some ice cream. But uh, it looks like the prices come down, because if I remember right, I it like was like eight down. or nine dollars a pint before, yeah. and it is forty one dollars and ninety four cents for a six pack. So that's like seven. Is that seven? That's like six something. Yeah, and then they also have an eight pack for fifty five ninety two. There you go. That's nice. Okay. Well, thank you. Creamier and it costs less. Now, I believe we like have a coupon code. If we do, I'm going to leave it down below. I don't remember if we have one or not, but if we do, it's linked down below uh, as well as a link for you to be able to purchase this if you're interested. The only downside is you have to buy six unless you happen to live someplace where they have it in stores like they don't down here in the southeast in right. Florida. Uh, and when you order from them, you can't mix and match flavors. Like you have to order six of the lemon, six of the mint, right. that kind of thing. So um, number five, five. Would, would we recommend it? I would definitely recommend it. I still enjoy it. Now, some people might not like the, the corn fiber, the soluble corn fiber in it, but it did taste delicious. And I like the fact that I don't have to put it on the counter for 30 minutes before I eat it. I definitely like that. Yeah, I mean, I think it's a great product. For us, the only reason that we stopped ordering ice cream is because we can't control ourselves no, with ice cream. There is not three servings so in ice cream. So we've gotten to the point now where we really don't keep it in the house. And if we want ice cream, we either make it or we run to the store and get it. And unfortunately, right. this one's not available in our area yet. 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 So... Uh, if you have it in your area, great. If you don't have a problem like we do where you're going to sit down and eat a pint every time you open the freezer and see it. You're going to love this. You're going to love it. I, I do. I think it's a great product. I love the folks over there. They make a good product. It tastes really good. And for the most part, it is very clean ingredients. Plus, it's helping the world. Well, if you like videos like this and want to see some other product review videos, make sure you check out our product review playlist, which you can find right down there. 
Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which you're gonna find right over there. But whether you check out this or you check out that, don't forget to do this. Subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. Bye.